Hey, we're live. Kyle must be muted or something. <laughs> Folks, it's Saturday night. Welcome aboard Murder Hobo Inc. One Shot Edition. Thanks for joining us. We appreciate it. If this is your first time, hang on. It's going to be a wild ride. Welcome nice. to the new year. Follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our YouTube archive. If you want to shoot the shit with us on Discord, hit us up on the Discord channel. If you want to buy our cool crap, like a phone case, it's down there. Uh, most importantly, if you want a seat on the One Shot, all this month long or on the talk show every tuesday m hobo inc twitch or i'm sorry twitter or gmail hit us up we will get you on the show uh tonight's episode they're going up against uh for lack of a better term leatherface and his family but before we get into the particulars and they derail wow. it let's go ahead and introduce you to the cast uh we will start with kyle kyle who are you and who are you playing um i'm kyle wow i am um, <laughs> i'm just confused and it's the 21st and i don't <laughs> know anything anymore <laughs> Yeah, I'm Kyle. Hey, Kyle. Who are, you, who are you playing? Who am I playing? I am playing uh, Clyde Frillo, the uh, light domain cleric. Fair enough. Uh, next up is Ernest. Ernest, who are you? Who are you playing? Hey, my name's Ernest, and tonight I am bringing back my character, Russell, the Kathleen fighter. Yeah, who's potentially a werewolf after the Halloween session. We something, don't know yet. Something I have not forgotten about. <laughs> uh, well, you found yourself a new group of adventurers to hang with since uh, wasn't there a shot that two of them turned into a werewolf? You and somebody I think, else? Yeah, I think so. Ugh. Yeah, I think me and my half brother. It was a horrific night. Uh, next up <laughs> is David. David, who are you? Who are you playing? Hi, I'm David. I'm usually on our Thursday night show and our Tuesday night show, uh, Cacophony. I am also the notorious Billy the Piper, if you saw our, uh, our New Year's Eve episode. So tonight I'll be playing uh, Torvig. He's a uh, um, he's mountain dwarf barbarian, um, battle rager. So he's an axe idiot. So this should be fun. <laughs> we'll go ahead and emphasize the latter rather than the former. Last exactly. but certainly not least, making her third appearance, which makes her one of us. One of us. <laughs> Anna, who are you and who are you playing tonight? I'm Hannah. I'm playing Octavia, a half elf druid. And you do realize that you are playing with three dipshits, right? <laughs> it'll be interesting <laughs> hannah's gonna die uh okay if you didn't see the intro folks uh with a few adventurers under their belt you and your associates have been approached by a local merchant named hamish ogden he is reporting that his uh riverboat ferrying business is uh under harassment by a group of individuals that are hanging out by skidmark keep a deserted fortress from years ago uh he's reporting that the harassment uh, appears to be these individuals are trying to stop his riverboat trade and that is going to be a problem hence he has hired you individuals with the promise of 200 gold pieces upon successful reacquisition of things and he's willing to give you ponies that you may keep uh, upon success of the mission the ponies will be given to you to go over land because he feels that surprise would probably serve you well directions are given it's a three-day journey a three-day journey uh, rest in peace mary wells uh, and you will be given the ponies and directions any questions or any haggling with hamish mm. I'll take that as a no. No, uh, no, no. Uh, in there are things in the soon to be published version of this that we are going to skip because of brevity, because we are going to shoot for two hours uh, as usual uh, on day three at midday, you reach a crossroads. Everybody give me a perception check. Not all at once. 
Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry. I forgot that I was playing a spellcaster, so I uh, didn't pick <laughs> any spells. Yeah, 16. <laughs> and that 20. I spent all that time trying to figure out what my modifier was. So yeah, so me roll. too. I was like, oh, shit. I haven't played this character in a while. Uh, nine. Nice throw. Uh, Hannah. Well. There you go. The Nat 20 is going to spot it first. There is a overturned signpost in the weeds as you pick it up, Russell. Uh, you nearly drop it on somebody's head. And you know what? Roll a straight up D20. One, two, or three. Uh, you can't handle the weight of the sign, and it falls over and hits one of them. <laughs> 14 <laughs> okay you hang it up uh and you twist it showing your way back to where you came from and it turns out that an old overgrown slightly beaten path uh is supposed to lead you to skidmark keep skidmark all right keep. i'm gonna toss the sign back into the grass and <laughs> let's keep going gonna go straight uh, I'm gonna follow the way the sign was supposed to point. <laughs> well, it got over. No, let's not play this game. <laughs> I don't Through know, you, Frank. I know don't, this game. Don't ask me my wisdom seven. <laughs> but if he doesn't ignore the plot, you guys have to face the dragon already, and that just doesn't work. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to so, go to Skidmark Keep or say fuck it and we? Uh, put it on the shelf because uh, i have come up with an mark. alternative <laughs> very good uh you would not have liked the alternative at all what was the uh, alternative uh, dragon <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> kind of dragon gemstone or ruby dragon i could oh. do with that that's fine yeah. okay yeah. you think but it was a young adult so oh. challenge level six Ouch. Not immune to fire. I am okay. <laughs> oh, it doesn't breathe fire. Exactly. <laughs> uh, your trip to Skidmark, blah, blah, blah. blah. Uh, after two more hours, you notice signs of more recent passing and you spot. Uh, let's see here. Uh, steering your mounts northward, you spy several people working in the field. Uh, give me perception checks once again, please. <clears throat> well, 18. Damn, 18. 10. Uh, 18s, Clyde and Torvig. Uh, these workers are being overseen by two females of poor charisma and the workers in the field appear as though to have bruises and cuts and scrapes. The two women spot you guys point at three uh, Octavia and they yell out, get. Uh Oh, I guess they're yelling at us. Uh... Oh, they, well. would, they would be directly yelling at you guys. The workers in the field uh, slow their work, but continue to do it a little bit. They do not appear to fall in behind the two, uh, for lack of a better term, uggos. And uh, it looks like uh, they're going to have words with Octavia. Oh, these look like the barmaids that are, uh, you know, making these guys work it off for not paying their bar tab. <laughs> Sorry. That's that. That's one reasonable explanation, Octavia. They are dead set on focusing in on you. What would you like to do? So they're they're upset with me. They're upset with uh, me. They they appear to be upset with all of you, but they're going to focus their rage on you because that's what chicks do. <laughs> <laughs> and my wife is throwing shit. <laughs> That's how you know it's accurate. That's right. That's <laughs> accurate because otherwise she wouldn't have thrown it. <laughs> I mean, I feel like I should try to be polite and make some sort of. Sure, go ahead. It's uh, Hannah. She's and, always the kind. Impress of me with your uh, RP. The other one you got to watch out for. Uh, yeah, Kayla, Kayla would have already killed them both. I was about to say we <laughs> played that scenario before. <laughs> So what do you want to tell them, uh, Octavia? So what are they trying to... They're, they're just... Get! 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 
Um. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I just like ask them about like the area, what they what get. They we don't need your kind here. Yeah. Each oh. of them brandish blades. Time for initiative. What? Yeah, these these bitches are packing. Don't expect that. <laughs> That's why it's Murder Hobo Inc. Oh. Oh, they not like elves or 17. something? They don't like tall people. Yep. Hannah and Russell? Or Octavia and Russell? Oh, sorry. <clears throat> seven. 12 and 7. Uh, 17. Torvig, you notice that the two ladies are closing on Octavia rather quickly. One of them is going to branch off. Nope. <laughs> I've rolled three, <laughs> three times in a row. Nice. They hate the druid. <laughs> oh, no. So you best step in to help out. Yeah, I'm going to step in front of uh, Octavia. And I'm going to be like, look, I don't like to hit the ladies, but you keep coming at us like this, I'll make an exception. Fair enough. Next up is the 12, Octavia. They seem to be hell-bent on kicking your ass. What would yeah. you like to do? I guess I'll attack. There yeah. you go. Right now. Make sure that you lean on Torvig for... Uh, no! <laughs> no, don't, don't lean on Torvig. He's got spiked armor on. Lean on me! That's the thing. It's just like the spiked armor isn't intimidating them at all. Huh? Nope. Uh, Octavia, do you want to go after Matilda or Eunice? Oh, which ones? I don't know. Which one's really going at me, both equally? Uh, you've seen the Goonies, have you not? No. Oh my god. <laughs> Pulling your nerd That's card. That's uh, beyond her time. That's yeah. probably true. Yeah. Uh, let, it, let us just suffice to say that these two are too ugly for tellies. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll go after Matilda. Is that okay. Her name? Yep, Matilda and Eunice. So you're going after Matilda. Yeah. Go ahead and give her a whack. Waltz and Matilda it is. Ten. Uh, ten is just not good enough. Uh, no bueno. Uh, next up is the seven, surprisingly. Russell. Russell! Uh, Russell, give me a perception check, please. Perception? Yep. Zero. Fair enough. Uh, Matilda or Eunice? Um, Eunice. Okay. I'm going to swing my sword and that is a modified 20 to hit mm -hmm. for what's my modifier plus four so 11 damage with my sword ouch she is not going to like that six is up next that is Matilda and oh. Eunice uh, since Torvik stepped up in front We'll see if they try and swing over his head. <laughs> nope, they're going to go after him. So Matilda's going to go after Torvig. Eunice is going to go after Octavia. And Clyde, you are going to get the dog that nobody saw. So on Torvig, eight. Nah, plus, no. they're not even close. Uh, on Octavia. Uh, 15 plus... Oh, these guys get two attacks. <laughs> uh, 19 gets you, Octavia. Yes. Okay. Uh, second attack on Torvig. Mm -hmm. uh, 13 plus 417. Does not hit. And Octavia, 6 plus 4 is 10. And the dog on the human... Uh, leaps forward out of out into a clearing with an eight. He is not going to get you, and he only gets one attack. Clyde, there's a dog that just fucking appeared in front of you. <laughs> uh, Clyde gets off his horse calmly. You foul wretches dare to approach a cleric of the purging light. Burn in the flyers of hell. 
flyers. I, I will. You're, you're you're talking to Torvig, uh, Octavia, and Russell, right? <laughs> Obviously, they didn't greet me properly this morning. Oh, Fair enough. <laughs> uh, and I will twin a guiding bolt at the sisters. Uh, so the first one is going to be a eleven, or I'm sorry, thirteen is what you need to hit the sisters. Sixteen is the first one. Yep. And a 25 for the second one. Hit them both. All right. The first sister will take 12 radiant damage as she begins to glow with the light of hell. Zartha. And the second one will take uh, 16 radiant damage as she is purged within with the fires of hell. There is a smoking hole in her chest. Top of the order, 17. Torvig, uh, blinding clerical fire has come out of nowhere past your spiky armor because you're something out of a Nintendo game tonight. Yeah. Uh, what would you like to do? <laughs> uh, I am going to make a reckless attack. This cannot go wrong. No, it cannot go wrong. <laughs> okay, what's the battle axe? So. You already have advantage if you uh, don't want to go reckless. I'm going anyway. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see. The first roll was 15. The second it's... roll is 18. Uh, eight, sorry. Yep, uh, 15 gets it. All right. Uh, versatile weapon, going to two-hand it. So let's see. 13 points of slashing damage. Nice. Uh, both sisters are pretty banged up. Octavia, you're up. All right. I'm going to go after Eunice specifically. Okay. Um, I'm going, I'm going to punch her. Okay. So. Uh, 14. 14 hits. Yes. Uh, give me 1d4 plus your strength. Six. Eunice had one hit point left, so as you knock her two front teeth out, she falls to the ground, striking her head against a rock and dies <laughs> on the spot. Russell! Nice. Russell! Eunice is dead. Uh, Matilda. Matilda's still there. Yeah, I'm swiping a Matilda with my sword, and that was a 12 to hit. A 13 to hit her. Oh, I miss. Thank God I get one more attack. Uh, the mask. So, of... action surge. You are, <laughs> again. You are a bitch. <laughs> 24 to hit. Okay, go ahead. You need three hit points of damage. Okay. Uh, six hit points of damage. The sword slashes through her neck. A thin line of crimson blood escapes and spurts all over Torvik. You know what? Torvig, one, two, Octavia, three, four, Russell, five, six. All right. Five, six. Russell, you've slashed her open, and she's spewing hot blood, drops her blade, and dies. Fortunately, the goddamn dog's there. Oh, 19 plus three. 22 there, cleric boy. Oh, uh, a disadvantage. Now, you didn't hit that thing for anything. I didn't hit anything for anything. That has nothing to do with it. As it tries to strike a holy man, a flash of light blinds it. Jesus. Do you remember this from Tamlin? That's right. <laughs> uh, reaction? It, a reaction? As a reaction. <laughs> as a reaction? 15 plus 318. That'll still hit, yes. Okay, good. Uh, give me a DC 11 strength or be knocked prone and take four hit points of damage. I am prone. Nice. Top of the order, Torvig. I am going to do an intimidation <laughs> attempt to intimidate the dog. You know, the dog's latched on to Clyde and can't see anything other than Clyde's groin. Oh, okay. <laughs> so unless you're going to intimidate its butt. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to attempt to grapple. <laughs> oh. No, Fair. no, please. please. Now's the time to use <laughs> bladed weapons. <laughs> <laughs> I've got go, blades go all right over through me. Now <laughs> <Yeah>. 20. <laughs> go 
Go ahead and grapple him, Torvig. Okay, so that's just a strength, right? Yep. All right. Uh, okay. And I get to roll against you for the grapple. Okay, 10. 10. Uh, did you add your strength? Uh, yes, I did. That uh, was the total. I, I did not. 11. He's slickery. Oh, damn dog. <laughs> uh, Octavia, the holy cleric of bullshit light, is on the deck and the dog is. Arr, arr, arr. What would you like to do? Did you skip me? I went after the dog. Oh, yeah, I did skip you. <laughs> did skip me. Yeah. Son of a bitch. Go ahead. Hold on, Octavia. You're uh, just trying I to need... steal the glory from the druid. That's it. That's it. Exactly. I need a constitution saving throw from the dog. And uh, I think everyone else around me. Let me check. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Who's hostile in this group towards Clyde? Russell hates humans. Okay. Russell. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a hostile make... towards you. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, <okay. laughs> uh, yeah. Just the dog and the dog failed with a three. Okay, that is 20 points of radiant damage as I in attempt to incinerate the dog. Did you see Galaxy Quest when they inverted the thing? That's what that dog looks oh, like. Oh, yeah, the transporter? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's dead. <laughs> it had five hit points. <laughs> it was worth it. So 20 Such is a bit creature much. cannot touch me. Uh, the people working in the fields start to slowly move forward towards you. Brand. Brand. <laughs> they aren't I hold up my sword. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. They, they they will pause. Come forth, my children. Come no, go me. away. <laughs> A male in the group goes, are, are 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 you gonna are you gonna blow me up like you did that dog? Only if you answer incorrectly and are a sinner in the eyes of the purging light. He moves to the back of the group. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody else want to try something, Torvig or a Octavia? Tick is noted. And <laughs> Clyde is now watching this last man with laser focus. Yeah, I'm just like, well, what do you want? You're free now. Just just. Go. We can't go. Our kids are still stuck in the Thorpe. Are we trying to? We're still. We're trying to get the dog to like stop. Nope, dog's dead. Okay, good. Oh. Yeah, he turned it inside out. Yeah. yeah, and we don't care about these kids either. We're just trying to get this two hundred gold piece reward, right? Are you here for the Northridge family? No, we're here for the. Uh, Skidmark keep place where the Northridge family is currently residing. I did not uh, know that. <laughs> <laughs> Russell, it would help to pay attention, especially during prayers in the morning. No, 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 no. I don't think you understand. Russell's been hit on the head a few too many times. <laughs> and he's, he's starting to itch. itch. <laughs> His leg reaches that, up. <laughs> that full moon is coming up tonight. Uh, yeah, the uh, peasants point out to you that the Northridge family uh, are the ones who you just killed uh, have forced them into indentured servitude. They are simple farmers that have lived in the Thorpe of Skidmark for a couple of weeks now. I'm sorry, a couple of months. The uh, Northridge family came in a few weeks ago and... Uh, have been causing all kinds of trouble. There will be trouble. Uh, these peasants ask, uh, except for the one cowering from Clyde, ask if uh, you can go in and deal with the Northridge clan and they can get their kids and live out their life in platitudes. Yes, well, we will slaughter them for you. Uh, sure thing. <laughs> slaughter? Why would we slaughter perfectly perfectly capable worshippers? Good Sorry. children to the purging light. <laughs> purge them, you, Clyde. Servants, go build a purge temple them. to the purging light. Or I will burn your families alive. Octavia, if you could just 
cast entangle on all of their mouths that would be very helpful at this point <laughs> in time. uh okay uh do you want to ask him anything else yeah how many uh northridge people are there uh in the written one there's like 12 uh, you are not going to deal with 12. Uh, they point out that you have to be careful about Jebediah, the clan leader. And since you just slaughtered the two wives, uh, their husbands are not going to be happy. Sawyer and Drayton, for those of you who are Leatherface fans, you'll recognize wow. those names. <laughs> so uh, I loot the bodies just to make sure there's nothing important, like they uh, have or something. Nothing. Zero, no. nothing. Goose egg. No keys. No no, keys. no, no keys. No jewelry. No gold. No gems. No nothing. They have the two swords, and uh, the ladies are wearing uh, leather circuits. Well, interesting. <clears throat> we'll need a guide to the keep. I suggest that man there. Why does this and points up? Clearly, you can see the keep on the cliffside. He has yeah, done his duty. <laughs> uh, one of the uh, individuals points out that there is a stone bridge that crosses the river. Excellent. Um, not lead the way, my man. Not leading the way. They are not going in there. They're I didn't scared say they, I just said him. No, Russell. <laughs> Clyde breathes a sigh of relief that he realizes he will not be incinerated by the holy goodness of, Cl or of Clyde. Feel Clyde like is not going to incinerate Clyde. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> what was that other guy's name? I don't know. Mm. I don't uh, think we gave him a name. You never gave him a name. You know what that means? Steve. Steve. Steve, <laughs> <laughs> Steve hovers at the back. Okay. So, uh, off you go. You want him to lead you? Yes. Uh, he begins to cry and slowly moves down the beaten path uh, to where several small buildings are present. Uh, he is openly weeping and trembling in fear. Good. The uh -huh. rest of you should all go home to your families <laughs> and rejoice <laughs> in the person light. <laughs> The, the remainder the, of their families are up The there. home is uh, are being guarded right now. They aren't going anywhere. We can guard your ponies. How far I is it on care. foot? <laughs> sure. uh, about two football fields away. Hmm. I'm an old man. I will take my pony with me. I am going to kill your pony just for sport tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay with that. I was going to kill it anyway. Uh, as you guys go down a winding path, uh, well worn by the slaves, indentured servitude slash peasants, uh, you come upon a small collection of buildings. Uh, ergo, the Thorpe of Skidmark. <laughs> <clears throat> All of the buildings are in disrepair and poor condition. Uh, as you move down the road, uh, Steve falls to his knees and begins to sob openly. <laughs> Please don't kill me. It was their fault. <laughs> and a small group of angry looking ugly fuckers comes around the corner. One is dressed in hide armor, wearing a goat's head as a helmet, and two seem to be adolescents wearing uh, leather armor and carrying a shield. They all bear a striking resemblance to each other, uh, but not like their moms, because uh, the moms weren't true Northridge people. They were just married in folk. They weren't gotcha. sisters. This isn't were, this isn't Mitch McConnell's Kentucky. The they were real. They were trying to spread out the gene pool a little bit. <laughs> That's right. Uh, I will take initiative from everybody as you have at this time. Three. Hello, assailants. my children. Twenty. Wow, I am keeping it up. Seven. Three. Octavia. Uh, ten. 
Ooh. 20, Torvig. Uh, these three don't look happy to see you, and they look puzzled as to why Steve is sobbing in the middle of the road. Each hefts a weapon. Uh, the guy wearing the goat head holds up a great axe and spins it around like he's a baton twirler. The other two have uh, scimitars. <laughs> okay. At this point, I would like to Raje uh, as my bonus action, and I will take my movement and engage Mr. Goathead. Yeah. So I am going to strike at him with the battle axe. And natural 20. <clears throat> okay. So damage. Uh, let's see. The first roll was 11. So does that double? Or how do we do a critical? Damage, damage modifier. Okay. So do I roll damage twice? If you want. Okay. All right. That was 11. Uh, 13 to what? 23 points of damage? Okay. 23. Uh, you done? Uh, yes. That was reckless, so I get advantage, correct? Uh, uh, no, I did not call reckless on that one. <laughs> oh, you went raging. Rage. Raging. Okay. Yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Woo uh, Goathead gets you 14 plus 5, 19. 19 just hits. Uh, da, 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 da. uh 15 damage max out as uh he's not too happy that you hit him okay uh, um i'm the, raging so that's cut in half isn't mm -hmm. it yeah because okay. it's slashing okay so, so seven seven uh scimitars are gonna go after dosed horvig and for russell Russell uh, on Torvig, 15 plus 4, 19. 19 does hit. Uh, D6. 5 plus 2 is 7, so 3 halved uh, okay. on Russell. Nat, 20. Uh, uh, 8 plus 2 is 10 on Russell. Ooh. Uh, next up is the 10, Octavia. Are we... So we're trying to kill this guy? Well, yeah. Torvig is. <laughs> there were no negotiations. All right. Who Tor are we'll, get, we'll get you in an RP game one of these days. Yeah, right. I was about to say. I was RPing. <laughs> the Torvig came on. Gosh, David, it's like this every time I play with you. I swear. <laughs> you can tr you can try and talk him down. Like, is it just him? Is he the issue right now? Right no, there? he he's got a uh, goat head guy and a teenager on him. Russell has a teenager on him. Everybody's been hit that have been in, or, uh, in your party. Those two okay. have, I guess. So I'm just standing around right now, like looking at them. Pretty much, you'll have to take your thumb out of your ass and then do something. <laughs> so I'll. Um, I say pick up Torvig and throw him at him because he's covered in spikes. <laughs> um, I'll like mace the the goat head guy. Sure. Do it to it. Um. I just did that. Oh, 21. That hits. Uh, seven. Added to the 23. Fair <laughs> enough. Seven is up, Russell. Russell, you got a teenager on you. Yeah, and I'm going to slash at him. And oh, that was a nat oh, 20. Oh, a him. So you're just now assuming you uh, misogynist shit magnet. Yeah, <laughs> I guess it so. was a dude. Okay, that's fair. Nat 20, um, go ahead. Nat 20. Uh, 
this uh was that double damage plus modifier damage damage modifier all right damage and that was seven 14 plus modifier four 18 damage oh he's dead <laughs> him he, he's yeah. dead he's dead oh okay just he didn't want to assume yeah, yeah. Since you've already <laughs> affiliated uh, his sexuality, we'll go ahead and stick with that. Last but not least, Clyde. Clyde, give me a perception check. Sure. Oh, okay. Uh, 30, 20. Yeah, there's some other footsteps coming somewhere. Uh, what do you want to do? One down, two up. Burn in the fires, you flat-chested witch. And I need a dexterity saving throw from the uh, other teenage lady. Because I'm not a shitbag. I pay attention. That's right. I don't. 13 plus <laughs> 2, 15. Uh, that passes. She is quite nimble. Uh, any half damage? No half damage. Fair enough. Top of the order, Torvig. You're covered in the blood of yourself and your enemy. Okay. I am still raging, so... And am... you will also notice three more participants are headed this way. Another goat head and another possibly male, possibly female combo. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm still on this one. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, you're not even half yet. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, with this, I am going reckless. Reckless and raging. Fair enough. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, does a 19 hit? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. With that, uh, 13 points of damage, bonus action. Gonna make a spiked fist attack. Okay. Uh, the <laughs> twenty-one to hit. Yep. Spike to the face, baby. Eight points of damage. He's not happy. Uh, and it's his turn. Uh, but first, let's see where the others are going. Uh, dose. That's not good for you. Uh, Uno, uh, that is, and big, big goat boy number two. Oh, Octavia, it's time to bleed. Uh, we will start with goat boy number one. Uh, you went reckless, did you not? Yes, so he's got advantage. Boom, but I am raging still. Uh, uh, 18 and 19. Either one of those hit. Uh, the 19 hits. Okay. Uh, T number one, which was also on you. 12 plus 4, 16 does not hit. Does not hit. Octavia, goat boy number two. Whew, four. Uh, Clyde, teenager number two. 16 plus 4, dirty 20. And Torvig, 17 plus 4, 21 on uh, teenager number two. They are just ganging up on you. They must, it must be turtle shell soup. So the great axe got you only. Okay. Two plus three is five. So two hit points. Okay. Uh, Clyde, did you get hit? I don't think so. Okay. Uh, did you swing at me? No, I did not. Uh, uh, yeah, I did. T3. I don't think T3 got you. Russell, you got hit, right? Yeah, the very first teenager that I killed hit me. Uh, four hit points of damage piercing. Uh, and that brings us to Russell. Russell! Uh, so there is the wolf person on Torveg, and where's the second one? On Octavia. On Octavia. And then there's two teenagers still alive? Three teenagers. Oh, so two more approached. 
Yep. And there was the one from the okay. Uh cool. I guess I'll go for a teenager. Um that doesn't sound creepy at all. Oh, I know. It's right? like teen spirit. That's right. Uh, uh so I'm gonna go for a teenager that's on Torvig. Okay. One. That's T four or T one. All right, that is a thirteen to hit. Uh no. Fifteen to hit the teenager. Thirteen oh. to hit the uh goat boy. Well, I miss. Octavia, you got a goat boy on you. Can I use the bark skin spell? You'd best. <laughs> <laughs> that increases your AC by what, two? No, it makes it AC 16. Ah, gotcha. Uh, and last but not least, uh, Clyde. Clyde, you have a whole lot of converts here. In case you haven't figured it out, this is your deadly encounter. Can't hear you, bud. I would like to cast burning hands on as many as possible. Oh, you're gonna, shit. You're gonna as get... many as possible. Fair enough. No. Uh, how many would I hit with as many as possible? Uh, two and Torvig, because he's fucking surrounded. Yeah. Two and Torvig. Uh, yeah. I shoot, can make shoot, a deck Shoot save, up higher. Right? Shoot up higher. He's a dwarf. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, that's, that's it. True. That is. That uh, is. I will actually. Um, I'll, I'll give you two and Torvig, the one on Octavia or the one on Russell. Because you got two teenagers and a goat guy on Torvig. Two teenagers and a goat guy on Torvig. And I can get one on Octavia or Russell. Or one on Octavia. Or one on Russell. Yeah, let's go ahead. Burning hands, Torvig. Okay. And I'll, I'll give Torvig advantage. Do I do a deck shot. save? Or no? What? Right. <laughs> we'll see if you are truthful about your prayers this morning, Torvig. Burn. Uh, so I need a dexterity saving throw from everybody. Torvig, uh, you get advantage because you're short. Uh, what do I need? Uh, DC 14 dex. Okay. Uh, 16 for Torvig. <laughs> one, of, one of the teenagers <laughs> made it. <laughs> one goat guy and one teenager did not make it. 6, 5, 4, 4. <laughs> uh, so, so how much? That is 19. 19, yes. Or half. 19 or half. Uh, and if there's a building nearby and it happens to be there, it also catches fire. So I take half for making the deck save. You take half. Half of 19. <laughs> half nine. of 19. <laughs> so nine. Uh, you kill two teenagers and goat man number one. So success. Uh, top of Four the order. Big, you were clearly. <clears throat> truthful in your prayers this morning as <laughs> wisps of smoke come off his eyebrows Torvik yeah. you're up <laughs> okay who's still standing uh, a teenager and goat guy number two on Octavia oh okay uh, I am going to how far away are they from me if I uh, moved about 12 feet 12 feet okay I will uh I didn't break concentration to make a deck save, did I? Concentration? For don't don't raging. I mean raging doesn't no, concentrate. That's no, you did you're taking hit. damage. Yeah. You took okay. damage. So you, you took a lot roll. of damage there. <laughs> okay. So so what does that do to rage if I take damage? Nothing. Keeps or? it going. Keeps yeah. it going. It's when you okay. do not attack or you do not take a hit is when it drops. Gotcha. So I am going to move up to Goat Boy and swing for the fences on him. Sure. He's uninjured. Okay. Uh, 18 to hit? Yep. Uh, let's Goat see. Boy's easy to hit. 13 damage, and I'm going to bonus action spiked armor attack. Uh, 14 to hit. Uh, yeah. Okay. And that's gonna, Spike's gonna get him for five. 
Fair enough. Uh, Octavia, one through five stays on you, uh, or one through four stays on you. Five or six goes after Torvig. Six, going to go after Torvig, so you're spared. Uh, on Torvig, did you go reckless? No, no, I did not go reckless. Uh, doesn't matter. 15 plus five. Dirty 20? Yeah, dirty uh, 20 hits. And then on Russell, three plus four is seven, so that's not going to do it. Uh, where's my D12? Seven plus three, ten, five damage. Okay. Uh, and we move to Octavia. Octavia, your goat boy has moved on to Torvig. Apparently he's not interested in you. Probably something that you said uh, or you didn't give him the time of day. So what do you want to do with him? Um, so nice. can I use the poison spray? To Why, get? yes. Yes, okay. you may. Give me, a wis- give me a wisdom check. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> you think? Uh, seven. Yeah, fire away. <laughs> oh man. Hey, uh, Torvig, you're about to get mouthwash. <laughs> What's my save? I've got advantage on it, though. Uh, rolled one. No, I I need a save. Uh, your um uh yeah spell save dc or does she have to hit with poison spray it's a save a constitution okay. save to be specific all uh, right so eight plus your wisdom modifier plus two i think i i got her though yeah i got it i got 18 so i take what half damage from poison none, none. did you it's save torvig uh, Constitution saving throw. Yep. Uh, <clears throat> yes, I did with a twenty-five. Uh, you overshoot Octavia and spray the ground, killing your precious plants. You bitch of a druid. <laughs> you are a horrible wow. druid. Your roundup. The Steve druid was like, right there. You could have <laughs> killed him, but you had to kill the sunflowers. That, that's right. You, you are roundup the druid, Russell. All right, I'm gonna go after this teenager again. And that is a 25 to hit. Easy. And that is six plus four, ten damage. Russell is really notching up the handle as another teenager. You feel good about yourself killing teenagers? Yeah. Feel good? Okay. They're they're way too tall for their age. Uh, Clyde, (laughs) you're up. There's one goat goat guy left. Good, Torvig. You brought them all together again. Uh. (laughs) Uh, (laughs) I'll take a dex saving throw from the goat man. So, and also Torvig or no, no. 14 plus 1 15 that passes nimbly he escapes top of the order Torvig okay I'm gonna I'm gonna engage goat boy again so all right uh, let's see Octavia needs to change her uh, 26 26 to hit or Monsanto. <laughs> yep. Uh, let's see. 26. Monsanto roundup. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, 12 points bonus action spike attack. Uh, uh, does a 13 hit him? Uh, just 13 okay. hits. All right. And he is going to take an additional eight points of damage. Got it. Uh, his turn. You know what? Odd even. Uh, Odd Torvig. Even uh, Monsanto. Three. Odd. He stays with you. You are not reckless, correct? Nope. Not reckless. 19 on the die. Plus 5. 24. Of course that hits. (laughs) 12. Plus 3. 15. Have to 7 damage. Octavia. uh, Your poison spray succeeded in clearing the path making the uh, cobblestone pathway look good uh, and probably woefully endearing yourself to the forces of evil. 
what would you like to do this time? So who is who? What? Just goat, just goat boy number two, who was originally on you, but now really hates Torvig. Yeah. I mean, I do want to help Torvig. Do you? Do that you would, really? Do you? Yeah. That would be nice. I don't think so. That would be nice. <laughs> I think you should go investigate elsewhere. <laughs> no. Um, I'm gonna... The plants! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna uh, kick him. Kick the goat, goat guy. Kick Torvig? Oh. Oh. <laughs> the head uh, guy. Uh, okay, give him a kick. Ten. Uh, nope, swing and a miss. <laughs> you didn't kick him. <laughs> Russell! Alright. Last enemy standing I'm going to attack, and that is a 15 to hit. Easy. Alrighty. And that is eight damage with my sword. Uh, and that was it. Clyde! Dexterity save. This is the one. I can feel it. Failed that one with a seven. Yeah. Burn with eight. Radiant damage. I thought you said burn with AIDS. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tap two. Top I know of the order. <laughs> Torvig, you're up. Okay. Uh, let's see. How many rounds has this been? <laughs> uh, this is round five. Still raging. <sighs> obviously i am getting winded because that was a nine to hit but i was gonna bonus action uh spike spike attack and that hits 20 not natural mm -hmm. uh i hit him for eight more points with the spike got it odd even Three again. He really just hates your guts. Yeah, he hates me. Uh, 16 plus 5 is 21. 21 hits. That is a 9 plus 3, 12, so 6 damage. Octavia, mm. goat headed guy, is really hurting. You want to finish him off? Yeah. Uh, I'll punch him. Everybody was druid fighting. Well. Someone knows karate. Uh, no, not the board. <laughs> Twelve, you punch him in the forehead, but that was the goat face. Russell, end this thing. I was really hoping Octavia would punch more teeth out. That would have been right. awesome. Modified 20 to hit. Yep. For oh, 11 hey, hang, damage. Hang on just a second. Octavia, did you add your strength modifier in that? Um, no. Do you have a strength modifier? Yeah. Is it one or better? <laughs> it's one. Octavia punches out his teeth and he there falls against a rock. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, that's how it's going to end for all of them tonight. That's, that's <laughs> right. Are, are you collecting these teeth, by the way? Because you have four front teeth if you want them. We should. Oh. Oh, we? That's... We? Whoa. Back yeah, off there, Rager. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I need a new dice set. So Mon Monsanto over there is the one killing these things. Uh, if they're Steve, molars. <laughs> Steve stands up, brushes the dirt off his knees, wipes away the tears, and goes, That's right. <laughs> and saunters off to a building. I set him alight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the rest of the farmers come running in and head directly for one building. Uh, now that it is unguarded, they open it up and small children roam free, hugging their loved ones, except no love for Steve because Aww. his pig has already been slaughtered. Oh, no. Oh, uh, as you stand in the middle of the square, <laughs> you notice the river runs uh, perpendicular or parallel to you, uh, as the case may be. There is a stone 
arched bridge that goes over the river. It looks very old. Looks like it was here since Methuselah's time. And then on the ridge above is the remains of a stone curtain wall uh, where the keep once stood proudly over this valley. I suggest that we rest so that these people may give their thanks to us and the light. And we take short rest. I yeah. appreciate it. And we it. may do better attacking that keep at night. Uh, may, <laughs> may I <laughs> plead for Brother Clyde to the, bestow the light upon me and give me a little healing? No, we're going to take a short rest instead. <laughs> short rest? Are you going to heal me? <laughs> <laughs> then I will consider it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, uh, yes. Uh, Russell, if, give me a D20 straight up. D20. Six. Okay. You can take your short rest. Thank you. All right. Good. I'll get that back. And I will give you some healing as uh, my hand glows with a dark light. And it's uncomfortably warm as I touch you. And I heal okay. you for... Five hit points. Okay, <laughs> I'll You're take welcome. it. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take anything. Uh, how bad are you still looking? Uh, I'm still halfway down. So really, yeah. Did you use the I hit dice? The shit out of him. He kicked the shit out of me. I got. Yeah. Do I? Do I? Um. God. Uh. Do I roll anything on a short rest? Any hit points? Or I mean, yeah, you okay. can. You can use as many as you like. One to three. Okay. And so it's however many you use plus. Okay. Constitution monster. Wow. Okay. You know what? Having a negative one constitution does not help. <laughs> what is it for a barbarian? Their hit dice. It's a D twelve, isn't it? D twelve. D twelve. It's your character, dude. Hey, dude, it's been a while. <laughs> like it's Caitlin, been a while. Caitlin asked me what time the game was tonight. Are you shitting <laughs> me? You've been playing forever. <laughs> okay, I'm good. There she is. You've been playing forever, Caitlin. Jesus Christ, you know we started at eight. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm good. I'm good. All right. All right. It is mid-afternoon. All right. Let us well, go forth. Build that temple. Purging lights. Off we go now. Exactly. Steve, say your prayers well tomorrow morning. Or oh, Steve's um, be yeah. Before we move <laughs> I'm on, I'm saying though, this out loud and pointing in a random direction. <laughs> I, I, I do want to loot the bodies of the people we killed. They have absolutely nothing of value on them. Absolutely, uh, I nothing believe there are value. two with goat heads on them. Yeah, I'll take well, a goat yeah. head. Okay, a rotting goat head. Yeah, I put it on. But no jewelry, no gold, no gems. Wow. All right. Now, some people believe that the gems and the riches in life aren't in material things. I'm wondering the stuff where you I'll... carry in your heart. It's yeah, the stuff no, you make along the way. <laughs> <laughs> so who wants to uh go across the bridge you can go two by two if you want i'll go yeah. i hear octavia and russell first uh as you reach the apex of the stone bridge you get a marvelous view of the river uh the river is uh maybe 30 yards across uh clearly made for boat traffic the bridge is high enough that any of the flat-bottomed uh merchant boats can uh, pass easily under them however when you reach the apex you notice something unusual uh there is a lot of uh, hemp netting here go ahead and give me it's testicle hair insight <laughs> it's back hair <laughs> i have an idea sea turtles uh... i have an idea we could be probably very successful bandit men that's true. You could be highwaymen here. Highwaymen, yeah. yeah. But both of you give me an insight check. Please. Oh. The two um, on the bridge? Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, let's see. I got a negative two. So 13. Octavia? Nine. Uh, the 13 will get it. Uh, it looks like the net is long enough that they're going to throw it over and capture any boat traffic that comes through here, uh, thereby prohibiting them from moving, making it much easier to abscond with riches. Interesting. So hmm. you have an option of destroying it or saving it. Uh, yeah, I want to save it. That seems like a, a way of profit later. Everybody hears a loud twang noise. Octavia and Russell, give me a D12. Hyrule gets a surprise. Uh, nine. Eleven. Oh, Octavia, a ballista bolt flies through the air and heads towards you okay. uh, and splashes into the river with a six. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. That was supposed to go better than that. Uh, the ballista bolt came from the keep. Uh, everybody should have enough information being third level that it's going to take at least a round or two for that ballista to reload. Uh, yes. Ahead of you on the other side of the embankment is terraces leading up to the keep. Uh, this was done for defensive purposes, making it uh, making intruders have to zigzag, thereby slowing them down. Uh, Torvig, Clyde, you would have heard and seen the splash and know exactly what's going on. Octavia mm -hmm. and Russell, as you stand on the apex of the bridge, do you want to retreat or slowly meander forward, checking out the flora and fauna on that side? Yeah. Say again? I want to go forward. Same. Forward. Fast. Fast or slow, Octavia? Fast. Uh, you guys take off running. Torvig, Clyde, uh, you see their heads <laughs> go down the other side uh, at a very fast pace. What do you two want to do? Shall we give chase, brother? Burn the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking burning the hell. It's but... a stone bridge. Well, I atop stone to flash. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> he's a and then fire pony. burning hands. <laughs> of course, I'm an old man. Why would I walk to the keep? I'm on a pony. <laughs> I will kick the uh, pony right in the nads or the ovaries, depending on what kind of pony it is. Uh. I honestly wasn't paying attention. And uh, right in it was full speed. ovaries. Okay, ovaries. Uh, okay. Give me a dex check for your pony. Dex check for the pony. Do I need to add anything? No, nope, it'll be zero. 13. Uh, it's a little bit slick on those cobblestone stone bridge, but your pony manages to cross it without throwing you over the side. <laughs> uh, Torvig, are you still on your pony? Uh, no. No, I didn't leave the pony. <laughs> not ponies. after that bullshit roll. I'm not. <laughs> My pony's dead on a spit somewhere. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, you will be running slower. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll sprint. So. Clyde, you will quickly catch up to Octavia and Russell, and if you wish to pass them, you may do so. Um, at least to the point of where I think I'm not going to get hit by a ballista bolt. Not a chance. It's a zigzag. You're running up Zorro. Whoever built this fortification did a nice job. Oh, good for them. Good for them. Yeah, yeah I'll continue on then. Pass them. Fair enough. Uh, first is the second and last ballista bolt. Uh, then the two arrows. So uh, the ballista bolt is going after Deuce Torvig bringing up the More. rear. More. Arrow four russell arrow three octavia uh here it comes Whew, two not even remotely close <laughs> uh, octavia 16 plus three that'll get you uh 11 plus three 14 russell uh, only Octavia catches one right in the skull. 
Oh, a murder hobo, which is what will be one. going to Octavia uh, <laughs> after this game. Six plus one, seven damage as Octavia screams out message for you. So uh, it's going to take at least one more round of charging up the hill. The good news is uh, doing the math in your head. The ballista is going to be out of the equation, but those damn uh, bows are going to be in there. So okay. uh, everybody continuing forward. He, 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 he. How far away are the bowmen? Uh, They're at the top of the hill. So uh, I'll say 40. 40. Uh, while riding the horse, I shoot some scorching rays at each of the bowmen. Now, you know, this pony's not trained for combat, right? You're right. I should ride it all the way to safety up to the wall <laughs> and then wait for everyone else to get up there. You're right. <laughs> I, I was a foolish, <laughs> foolish person for trying to be a holy person. If Time you to wanna, murder Hobo up. If you want to fire at him, I'm fine with that. I'm going to make you roll an intimidation check on the pony for each... Oh, uh, shit, I'm really good at intimidation, though. I don't want to intimidate the boy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it a good intimidate or bad intimidate? It would be a bad intimidate. Yeah, I don't want to do that then. I, I would succeed. <laughs> okay. Uh, you put your hand out and think, uh, no, I'm not going to do that. Uh, you write uh, it. It's her. Uh, I want to smell their flesh up close. Arrow number one comes at two. Arrow number two comes at one at point blank range. Uh, on Clyde. Uh, disadvantage. Uh, I, that was a two. <laughs> disadvantage, Frank. That was a two. Dis disadvantage. And an if 18. You roll a one, you might fall out of the tower. I don't I, know. That's true. 18. <laughs> uh, on Torvig. Uh, six. My bowman skills suck ass. Clyde is the first one to get up there for melee range. Uh, there are two Northridge teenagers here. Wee, wee, wee. Uh, Clyde, you can engage them and they will focus in on you while Torvig, Octavia, and Russell run up and attack next round. Can I not attack them and let them continue to attack the other three for the next round? Dick. I will let you ride <laughs> past them. Negative and, constitution. I, I will let you ride past them, and then I will roll. 50% says, ah, fuck it, I'll shoot those three. 50% says, uh, I'm going to shoot them in the ass. I tell you what. And I'll Clyde, even let you roll. Clyde is a righteous man. He hops off his pony. My lord will protect me. Pew, pew, pew. And scorching ray the three of them. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> Ricochet <laughs> rabbit there? over here. <laughs> uh, eighteen plus. Uh, that is a fifteen. Fifteen hits. Fifteen hits. And that is a seventeen plus. So you hit them both. Oh, there's only two. I thought yep. there were three. Nope. Oh, okay. Uh, somebody's um, somebody else is firing the ballista. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Uh, so that is 11 on the first one. Fire. Okay. That is 9 on the second one. Fire. Uh, despite their charred efforts, do you have oh, anything else? I've got one more, and so I'll double up on one of them. Sure. And that is 6. Back will, again on the first one. That will kill him. Uh, the other one... Ah, oh, that would have been useful. Flee, wretched creature, or bow. Well, bow or be burned. I don't care which at this point. 12 plus 4, 16? Huh? 16? To hit? Yeah. No. Okay. Uh, swing and a miss. Uh, round two, I will let Clyde do something, and then you three can roll for initiative. Okay. Since he's right there. Uh, give me the pony a... is running willy nilly through the ruins now. That's okay. <laughs> um, you have survived the fire, and you were destined to live and serve that or be burnt to a crisp. And I would like to intimidate him 
and uh, be a little bit more role play. Is that okay? Sure. Is that okay, Frank? Sure, that's fine. Okay. Am I and am I going to get kicked in the head for this? Does a twenty-one intimidate this young teenage person? Oh yeah, he wets himself. <laughs> he wets himself as a small circlet of urine forms on. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to be a shitlord like Russell on her pantaloons. There you go. And she drops her sword like not Count Rugal, Prince Humperdinck. Prince Humperdinck. There, oh, she, there drops her, she drops her blade like <laughs> Prince Humperdinck. <laughs> Good. The burning has made you quite ugly, and I see the gods had already blessed you. You, you cure the burning serve. in my loins? <laughs> no. That's a daily oh. penance you must pay. <laughs> a Russell issue. <laughs> uh, she backs away down the uh, remains of the curtain wall. And sit. Eh, you're going to have to do another roll for that one. Done. That is a 24. She sits. <laughs> <laughs> sit, child. <laughs> uh, the rest of you arrive at uh, Sure, finally. Uh, <laughs> you should are... have rode your ponies in. I've been waiting for hours. Yeah, no, you shouldn't have ridden your ponies in. Uh, by the way, your pony is somewhere else now. Uh, as you look at the ruins of the old manor house, there appear to be three major entrances. Uh, this place has sustained a significant amount of damage. There are only a few parts of the roof that are still intact. You can go through what looks like it used to be a hallway on the right, you can go into what appears to have been a courtyard in the center, or you can go into a room on the far left. Are you okay, children? Do you need to be healed before we continue on? You referring to us? <laughs> yes. Nobody caught the ballista, so uh, okay. I thought yeah. someone took a ballista to a face. Uh, Octavia uh, took, yeah, an took an arrow to the head. To head. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looks like Steve Martin. <laughs> Joke was lost on everybody. Pull that out. But, but <laughs> oh come on, it's Steve Martin. Of course we know what you're talking about. <laughs> At least uh, I do. Uh, Octavia is smiling sweetly, and Russell is. She has no idea. Head, no. <laughs> okay. So, Lead the way then. Octavia, did you want him to heal you first? Uh, yes. Then ask. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Demand. <laughs> hey, jackass, heal me. Yeah. Please. <laughs> Corvig, who asked for healing, got one plus four. You, who didn't, got eight. So you nice. get 12 hit points back. Dick. <laughs> I don't control how the dice rolls. I'm I know. Just saying. I, I understand. I understand. So, left, right, or center? Uh, um, what place looks like a scary head of the Leatherface Colony would live. Right. Down the dark hallway. Then All the right. opposite way. that place of fallout. <laughs> oh, you, you're just going to set it on fire. Just going to flame it up. Burn the entire place down. We accomplished our mission. That's worth 200 gold pieces. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> oh, a week later, that net goes over the bridge and they, they kill off uh, Hamish's boys. <laughs> <laughs> you want to flame it up? No, no, no. Okay. We we should do this intimately. Um, maybe maybe it's easier if we uh, get them to come here. I maybe I should shout really loud and ask them to come out. You should do that. You should, definitely should do that. All right, I, I do that. I uh, I start shouting very loudly at the entrance, saying, "Hey, you cowards, come to the front entrance." Perception check, everybody. Oh yeah, I get a tarnation. Uh, la 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 la. Fourteen. 
Bun, bun, bun. Octavia. A 21. Fortunately for you, Octavia, uh, as these guys are bellowing down the hallway, you're hearing wheels. Oh, shit. Creaking wheels. Are they close? Yep. They're close. They're coming in from behind you. Hmm. You want to take a peek? Uh, yeah, I would like to see who it is. Uh, as you do this, uh, two goat-headed guys are rolling out a ballista, and they're going to shoot. <laughs> and they're blank range. Uh, yep, because you guys are yelling. Yeah. Uh, and they are shooting at number one, Clyde. Disadvantage. <laughs> Yeah, like hardcore disadvantage. <laughs> like Clyde just needs to sidestep and they have to like wheel the thing around. <laughs> <laughs> just keep moving, Clyde. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Did you do the 2020 again? I did the 2019. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, we're gonna have to get we're gonna have to get yes. you a dice cam we're gonna have to get you I, a I, dice and now I sh- Clyde, I should, yeah. Clyde goes flying into the courtyard across the Clyde is dead. Clyde goes right past Russell eh, you got lucky there eight hit points of damage that's uh, half my hit points Thank and you. you're pinned to the door hey, that's a five a two and a one yeah uh, this roll would have been ooh only eight, two ones and a six. Uh, Torvig, Russell, uh, Clyde limps forward with a ballista spear in his leg, and Octavia goes, uh, "Hey guys, there's a ballista back here." Everybody, roll initiative. Yeah. All Ugh. right. Uh, Fourteen for Torvig. Twenty-three. Eight. Nothing wakes you up faster than a ballista bolt to the leg. Could have been your anus. <laughs> Ten. <laughs> Everybody beats me because I rolled a seven. We'll start with a 23. Russell, there's uh, two goat-headed guys here. Yeah, I'm going to just run However, up However, and... one of them looks younger. Okay, I run towards the tallest one. I don't I don't care. Okay. Um, the taller one gets 22 to hit from my sword. That hits. All right, for eight damage. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, 14 is up next, Torvig. I would like to rage, please. Seeing the ballista stick out of Brother Clive's leg like Jim Carrey in Ace Ventura 2. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> He's going to walk like Festus here in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. Net 20. Yep. That's Again. an arrow to the knee, Clyde. You have to retire <laughs> by law. Okay. Are you going after the same one Russell went after? Yes. Okay. Same one. Okay. Nine plus, uh, let's see, 17 points of damage, slashing. Oh, yeah. And okay. he only had two left. You wasted that nat 20 roll. <laughs> hey, I had to take it. <laughs> uh, Ten is up next, Clyde. Bombadilla, Bombadilla. So there's only one left? Yeah, and he looks older. He's shorter, though. Okay. I will, um... And he looks like all the other males. Okay. He's a Northridge boy. Uh... Not to be confused with an Oak Ridge boy. I was about to say, that's where I live. (laughs) Uh, Did he get hit? Nope, he hadn't been hit yet. Okay. Uh, Give me a wisdom saving throw, please. Not their strong suit. <laughs> uh, two will confirm not their strong, their strong suit. suit. <laughs> so that's a two. All nice. right. I should probably not roll a d20 for damage. Probably Although not. that was a great 19. <laughs> uh, three necromantic damage. Uh, yeah, I don't have anything special for this one. Octavia, you're up. 
One goat headed man. How and close is he? He's in melee range, and you can tell that he's going after three, you. <laughs> <laughs> dice giveth, dice taketh away. Wow. <laughs> um, so, like, is he close enough that I could mace him? Sure. Yeah, you did the hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> and just kind of did the matrix move as the ballista bolt flew into Clyde's oh, leg. Right, right, right past her. <laughs> that would have been awesome to just crit you on that one. <laughs> that would have sucked. <laughs> Clyde is now a popsicle, and we haven't yeah. even reached the bad guy. <laughs> Hit him, Octavia. 16. Yep, that hits. Um, for damage? Yep. Six? Eh, eh, could be worse. Could be better. Uh, he hefts his axe, yells out, Hassan, chop, and brings it straight down for your head. 14 plus 5, 19. And that axe buries itself, giving you, oh, are you shitting me, uh, four hit points of damage. <laughs> I rolled a one. <clears throat> uh, that takes us to the top of the order. 23. Russell! Russell! All right. So is there just one of these guys left? Just one. All right. Just to make sure. Cool. I'm going to swing it with my sword. Ten to hit. And I whiff it. Swing and nice. a miss. Torvig, 14. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yep. Still Rajang. So. Uh, uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Roll a d4. Clyde is one. You're two. Octavia, three. Russell, four. Roll a d4. Okay. And the magic number is one. Right in Clyde's face. <laughs> <laughs> I am so sorry, Clyde. Far worse now. <laughs> Do your damage and have it. <laughs> Seriously? Oh. Fuck yeah, it's a one, dude. Uh, <laughs> have you played on this show before? <laughs> oh, man. Uh Were we uh, gifted healing potions uh, for this adventure? Oh, remember, you guys didn't want to talk. <laughs> decided to fucking leave. <laughs> Thank God. I, I rolled spells. I rolled terribly on my damage. So three points of damage. Oh gosh, I'm so close to death right now. Well, it's your turn, Clyde. Good. If you want to heal yourself, please. <laughs> I would do that, but I prefer the murder more than anything. And I point at this gentleman. And uh, make another wisdom saving throw for me, please. <gasps> you ten. Know so that's a ten. I gotta watch where I'm swinging that thing. <laughs> uh oh. I have reached a boo boo. Uh oh. I don't have any d12s. Can someone I roll a d12 for me, please? Gotcha. <laughs> I, I just lost my d12 as well. It went under the table. Can't find it. Seven. He dikes seven points of necrotic damage. Octavia, you're up. You felt the cold whiff of Torvig's blade as it missed you and smacked into Clyde. Uh, he made me miss. Um, I mean, I will remember you. I'll Will you close enough? I'll punch him. Sure. You like the martial arts there, I, karate. I mean, yeah. Uh, 18? Yep, that hits him. Shouldn't you be yelling out ay, 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 when you're doing that shit? No, I don't need to. Um, damage is two. Just saying that's quality RP. Yes. <laughs> Just saying. Uh, it's That's, my turn. Uh, before her time. Let's be fair. That's true. Uh, Are you talking about Xena? 
Yes, I am. Oh, see, that wasn't before my time. Yeah. Lucy Lawless, I watched the shit out of that. And then Hercules with Kevin Sorbo. See, oh, I'll get to yeah. all those references. <laughs> Three, Octavia. He really does not like you. Uh, 12 plus 5 does a 17 get you. Because you got Bark Skin, which takes it to 16. What's your dex? Thirteen. So plus one. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I still got you. By the power of Gray Skull. No, oh, no. <laughs> uh, Fourteen damage. As he Hassan chops the shit out of you. Back to the top of the order, Russell. This is starting to turn ugly. You got a couple of teammates. How, how far are you down, Octavia? Uh, hit points. Um, so I got her with the arrow. I do not know. I need a second. Okay. How far are you down, Clyde? Nine. Ooh. Yeah, Russell, it's starting to get in deep shit trouble here, and this is not the big bad guy. <laughs> 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 All right. I'm going to swing at this last guy here for 21 to hit. I did some damage. Uh, let's see. 10 damage. Yeah, that's some damage. Some damage. <laughs> some damage. Torvig, 14. You're up. Okay. Let's see if I can hit on Reckless time. Recklessly beat him to a pulp. <laughs> you're, hit, you're hitting great grandpa here. I you guys am, feel good about this. I am going to go reckless uh, on this attack. So... All right. Good news, Octavia. That means I'm almost destined to roll a two on who it attacks right. next. <laughs> First roll is a 16. Second uh, roll. That it's 14. Okay. Yeah, both hit. All right. So I am going to hit him for a big whopping nine points of damage. Bonus action spike, spike attack. Uh, it's a swing and a miss with an eight. Uh, Clyde, you're up. You go reckless the entire round. Right, right. Oh, you only rolled an eight. Spike and oh, 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 I am so sorry. Yeah, yeah. the entire round. Okay. The entire round, everything that you roll. <laughs> a one. <laughs> Eleven. <laughs> Eleven doesn't get you either. Thanks for reminding me. I was just like, I, was, uh, I don't know why I didn't think that counted, but okay. There you go, Clyde. Good bonus action. Um, how, how bad does he look? Not about bad half. About, oof, oof. A, little, a little over half, maybe. A little over half. Hmm. Certainly he's, unless you and Octavia pull a rabbit out of your asses, he's going to get an attack this round. Grapple. I, I could pull a rabbit out of my ass. You don't know what I have in my ass, Frank. Uh, give or me that wisdom saving throw, please. <laughs> I love our producer. <laughs> uh, 15. Giving me a 15. Yes. Octavia, uh, he's hit you. He's gone after you twice and hit you once. Uh, he clearly does not like you. You're, uh, I would also like to mention that I am very far away from this gentleman and am nowhere near him to fight him. <laughs> Over his ass. What you want to do, Octavia? Pound this clown. Is he swinging at me right now? Uh, he did last round. I haven't thrown to see who he's going to go after, but since Torvig's okay. rolling recklessly, I'm hoping for a two. <laughs> um, the, I'll use the poison spray again. Sure. What's my save again? Ah, never mind. That's an 18. I Duck, dodge. Dip. Dip, dodge. Da yeah, yeah. Duck whatever. Dive. Yeah, yeah, duck dive. Dip. Uh, Dip and I, I dive and dodge. I, you swing it a bit. You spit poison at him, and I go after. Wah, wah, Russell. That's bullshit. Uh, 10 plus 5, 15. Oh, that misses. Top of the order, Russell. 
All right, I'm going to swing back. Six plus six, 12. Does that hit? Nope, you need a 13 to get him. Torvig. All right. Sucks. All right. Reckless attack again. <laughs> End on. him. Not okay. a chance. Could roll a nat 20. You don't know. Yeah, that's I true. Missed twice. You missed twice? Yeah, wow. both rolls a 12 and a 2. So, But I am going to use my bonus action to, to hit him in the face with a spike. Uh, okay. Ones, 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 ones. Natural 20. Ones, 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 24 to hit. Yep, that yeah. is. Him. Okay. He at least gets a spike to the face for a big whopping six points of damage. Yeah. Do you, Xena, yell it? Yeah, I do. Yeah, <laughs> take note, Octavia. He's Zena yelling. <laughs> Clyde, you're up. Uh, now, now she's uh, going to have to watch Zena. Yeah. <laughs> well, highly recommend it. Yeah, I agree. It did not age well. Yeah, it did not. <laughs> no, they probably not. It. 13 to hit with a guiding bolt. That hits. They need and to use uh, the chick from the Mandalorian as Zena. Yeah. Gina... Gina Carina, yeah, Carano, yeah. yeah. I use her from Deadpool, and then use Taylor yeah. Swift as the other one. <laughs> How much damage? Eighteen radiant damage. Holy shit, uh, Octavia! This guy is not looking good at all. Like one hit point. Can you hit him? <clears throat> Punch him. Knock his teeth out. Yeah, I want him to hit his head on a rock. <laughs> yeah, all right, I'll punch him. Okay. Roll I'm like two d twenties and take the higher one. I should get advantage. I'm like Billy. That was a guiding kid. bolt. A so after I hit him, he glows. Gotcha. Seven. Say again. Seven. Nope. What was your other roll? Five. <laughs> <laughs> he has one attack left. <laughs> Wow, wow. Were you reckless, Torvig? Yeah, I was. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so he has advantage. <laughs> well, the first roll was only a 15 plus 5, dirty 20. The other one was a, what's a 2 0. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> damn those dice, man. <laughs> I, I haven't rolled this well since uh, New Year's Eve. It don't, yeah. Don't worry. Come. Oh, uh, look at that. <laughs> that's a lot. Uh, 14 is seven. Seven? Okay. S seven damage. All right. Got it. Russell, end him. This is it. Can I be, am I inspired by this guiding bolt? Or no. is it just the next attack? Got it. Just the next attack. Uh, 19 to hit. He's dead. Oh, are you sure? That was seven damage. He only had one hit point left. All right. <laughs> Octavia had the chance to snag more teeth, yet she choked. Poor Octavia. Probably from that huge gash down the middle of her face from that last battle axe attack. So that or, was the big bad, right? We're done? Nope, that was not All the big bad. Done. Let's go home, boys. Yeah, we're finished. Job you know well what? done. That's right. You, Let's you can burn leave. the place down. I think that's the way to go at this point. Yeah, I think yeah. so, too. <laughs> can, can we just return to uh you also haven't found any loot and uh say we completed the mission and bring back a few of these uh heads as per you certainly can um do the might... bodies have anything on them yes nothing wow i rip out their hearts to see if there's anything in those there are not okay. there are no hearts there are no you're, hearts yeah you're you're, you're <laughs> Coming up from below to reach their heart <laughs> <laughs> through the stomach. I, I know how to get yes, to a exactly. man's heart. Uh, <laughs> so Kali Ma, yeah. You have not found any loot whatsoever from these banditos. If you want to try and burn the place down, you may. Nah, we should probably explore first. All right. Now you yeah. know what? Who's looking awful? Go ahead and give me an insight yeah. check. <laughs> Insight. I'll take that. Two. Uh, let's see. <laughs> I know how to weed out those whose thoughts are impure. That you is know, 22. for a barbarian, I am deeply insightful. 
<laughs> 21. <laughs> and Octavia? Uh, 17. Uh, you three say, you know what? We ought to wheel this thing through the ruins. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> <laughs> are, are there, I rip are there out any... the thing from my leg and I stick it in the ballista. I was going to say, are there any other bolts? <laughs> nope, just the one in his leg. Okay. And we hook up the pony to it. <laughs> <laughs> the pony's right in front of it. <laughs> exactly. It goes through the pony and into whoever we're going. That's, it's that's, the, rise that's, rise. that's the pony's motivation. It keeps hitting it in the ass. <laughs> make, make sure Caitlin knows that my little pony just got shot with a ballista bolt or is about to. Okay, ghouls. My little pony. Uh, my little Clyde, are you going to try and heal anybody before the big bad shows up? Um, who needs healing? Now nah, we're mean, fine. I, I'm down Octavia. <laughs> okay. It does. So, She's not going to ask, so that means she gets a higher roll. That's true. I will uh, twin and heal both Octavia and myself. Uh, and I'm going to take the higher dice from me. <laughs> uh, that is nine points of healing to you and I. <laughs> so you can follow the hallway down, keeping in mind that if there are any side rooms it's going to take a full round to turn the ballista russell you should go lure anyone out sorry hold on that was not my what what's the height of the ball <laughs> just wondering russell, lure them out because right, uh, right about penis level. <laughs> penis level of a halfling? Uh, so this thing's a foot off the ground? Yes. Like, <laughs> it's going to go low, but it's going to go fast. And it skids up. That's yeah. right. It's gonna, they're going to skip shoot off the cobblestones. Yeah. All right. No, I, I'm not standing in front of this thing since Frank isn't clarifying the height. <laughs> Look, it, it, would we it, hit you intentionally? Yeah, you no, got hit already. I would <laughs> set you on fire intentionally, but I would never shoot you intentionally. If he's going to shoot you, it's going to be completely by accident with a one. Right, Torvig? <laughs> Besides, you don't know which one of the three has their finger on the trigger. For all you know, it could be Octavia. She might like you. Then again, maybe she doesn't. <laughs> So Russell, do you want to lure him out? Um, no, I do not trust <laughs> the rest of my group. <laughs> I say we just shoot the bolt right through the doors at the end of the hall. Are there doors at the end of the hall? Maybe I should ask that first. Uh, no, there are no doors left. That's nice. Uh, but you can peek around the corner to see what's in there. All right, I'll peek around the corner very stealthily. Uh, there's no ceiling. This used to be the Great Hall. And I don't see any living beings in here. Nope, you see an exit on the far side. All right. I turn around and tell that to the rest of my group. Great. <laughs> <laughs> I do not appreciate this. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> and it's Octavia with her finger her itchy trigger finger <laughs> ready to go hit the high note Russell Russell <laughs> uh, you tell the others uh, that there is an egress on the far side okay I, I suggest someone else lead um, <laughs> I I'm just the fighter you tell me where to go, I'll, I'll run. I, I'm just the meat shield with the most hit points, but fuck you guys. I'm not gonna <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not going to make the decisions. How about that? I'll, I'll be in front, but I really don't know where we yes, should go. Yes, be in front, Russell. That's what we've been asking you to do. Y yes, yes. I am, Continue I'm here. forward now into what? the great hold. <laughs> Russell, we want you to go right there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Russell, do you go to the end of the uh, Great Hall? Yeah, fuck it. Since the rest of the group isn't helping. 
When you reach it, you come across a long hallway going left and right. To the left, you hear chanting. Ooh, I start going that way. Uh, the ballista crew, are you following? Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, who's going to D12 against me to see if this thing will actually fit through this doorway? Oh, it'll fit. Seven. I don't have a D12 roll. Oh, yet. what was that that you <laughs> held up? <laughs> All right. Nine. It will well, nothing beats Frank more than Frank. That's oh, right. so so you rolled for us. Okay. Yes. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Uh well when I we, rolled a twelve. <laughs> gotta be faster, man. Uh Octavia, Torvig, and Clyde. Rattle, 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 rattle. You maneuver it through. Nice. And Russell is going to the left. Okay. <laughs> uh, Russell. We keep them in our sights. The chanting is about three doors down on the right. Is there any braziers in this great hall filled with oil, perchance? No, no, that's a brazier. No oh, torches. No torches. No lamps. Torches. No. Just torches. Just torches. Okay. Does anyone have oil in their packs? Mm, that is Who are we kidding? Of course, I do. I would always I... have oil. <laughs> Edwin, Edwin I will... Larry goes nowhere without oil. <laughs> I take a little extra moment to rip a little piece of my robe off, wrap it around the head of the ballista, soak it in oil, and grab a torch and get ready to light it before someone fires it. Oh, this Russell. is going to go so well. <laughs> Russell, as you creep down the old hallway, uh, you see a glow coming from where the chanting is at. You want to peek in? Stealthily, <laughs> yes. Uh, as you stealthily peek in, you hear some cracking as corn kernels have been left in the doorway uh, to alert the individual in a curved ram's horn helmet he turns around looks like he'd say calamar uh but he begins to blaspheme you sinner you have invaded my territory and you must now pay and he takes his battle axe and just cuts a swath through his chest and the blood begins to ooze everybody roll initiative does the ballista, and ballista get its own initiative? <laughs> nope. 11. 14. Seven. I feel a like-minded individual near me, and it just warms my cockles. Russell? 22. Uh, Russell, you get to move first. Uh, you are looking into what appears to be a chapel. Uh, there's a ram's head and... Uh, fleece hanging on the wall blood dripping everywhere this guy's got the ram head with the curled horns on him looks like he's some kind of acolyte asshole uh, and he looks older but he looks just like all the males you've met and he screams scripture at you before he attacks what would you like to do uh yeah i'm gonna attack him first sure go ahead and that is a 25 to hit that hits Easily. Or eight plus four, 12 damage. Nice. Jebediah is not going to be happy. Uh, 14, Torvig. I had an 11. Oh, I'm sorry. 14 is Clyde. I'm looking at it wrong. That's okay. Um, with the rated action, I set the ballista bolt on fire. Okay. And uh, can I open up a door to... Real quick, is the ballista pointed into the chapel at this point? It is not. It is not. Okay. How much effort is it going to take to get the ballista to point into the chapel? It's going to take two of you to push it into the chapel. However, Russell is engaged. I'm willing to take that chance. 
Uh, okay. Uh, unfortunately <laughs> for you, I also got an 11. Octavia has a 10. So Torvig and I are going to go at the same time. Torvig, do you want to help push the ballista in? Oh. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, I will attack. I think I get two attacks, too. Kyle, I want to see where this goes, man. <laughs> he screams out, by the power of Maud, I sentence you to the underworld, you savage sack of shit. And a four to two. <laughs> <laughs> Maud swings over and under Russell's head. Uh, Octavia, Torvig, and Clyde have pushed the ballista into the doorway. The tip of it is lit on fire. You can pull that trigger and hope you don't hit Russell <laughs> or do nothing or say, fuck it, I'm going to jump over and help Russell out. The ball's totally in your court. Hold! <laughs> hold! Hold! What do you want to do, Octavia? Uh, I kind of want to shoot it. Oh, man. Ding! <laughs> Go ahead and roll an attack. <laughs> Please be a one. Please be a one. Please be a one. <laughs> um, You're killing us. <laughs> drama, Frank. Drama. Drama. She, she's already at the drama. What is it? Roll an attack? Yep. Okay. Um... 18. Oh, that sucks ass. Uh, the ballista bolt fires and impales uh, Jeb Jebediah Northridge. Uh, that's going to be 3d6 plus another d6 because it's on fire. Uh, Octavia, roll me 4d6. You're the one that pulled the trigger. Burn in the flames, blasphemer! 14. That's going to hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, top of the order, Russell. A I mean, is this guy dead? Oh no, it's only twenty six hit points. This is the BBG, so it is. Uh, oh shit! Yep, it's nine forty nine. Of course, it's the BBG. All He's right, I guess I'll attack DM again here. <laughs> since a, a bolt sticking out of his chest isn't enough. Yep. Oh, I'm sorry. There was a bolt sticking out of Clyde's chest too. Yeah, but it wasn't on fire. Um, it cauterized his wound. <laughs> cool. I uh, I rolled a two to hit. So oh, that, that'd be a miss. That I think a that's a miss. Yeah. Uh, Torvig and Clyde, you're going to have to get the ballista out of the freaking way or jump over it. Uh, either way, it's going to cost you guys an action. Clyde, if you want to jump over, that's your action. And Torvig and Octavia will have to decide whether they pull it out or jump over it as well. Can I shoot over? Yes, you may. I will do that. Okay. That Ooh, that's a 19 on the die for 25. And we guiding bolt you again for the final time. It's the final count. Uh, 11 radiant damage. Up to 37. Be purged in the lights! Torvig, uh, it's going to take you and Octavia to move this, or you're going to have to jump over and waste your movement. Either way, it's a wasted movement if I got to move it, right? Correct. So I'm just going to jump over it. Give me a dex check. All right. Please be a one, two, or three. <laughs> ha! 22. You leap over. Octavia, uh, it looks like nobody's going to help you, so you can try and tug it out of the way or leap over it and help next round. I'm leaping over. Give me your dex check. Four. <laughs> you land poorly. Uh, Russell, it's you and I, and I am mad. By the light of hell, I send you to meet your demon creator. Nat 20 and an eight. <laughs> what the hell, man? He's bringing the pain. Boom. 
Uh, 15 damage as I slice you like a hog, and it's your turn. Oh, man. That was rough. Um, You're welcome. Okay. Don't worry. Octavia will come after you as soon as she untangles herself out of the bowstring. I'll attack, and that was a 24 to hit. That hits. For 11 damage. You know, you guys are whittling them down. Uh, Clyde. Right turn, Clyde. No, now. Right now. Now I need the... Oh, now you're jumping? Okay, give me your dex. Can I do so carefully and with great caution? No. <laughs> <laughs> because you have to leap over Octavia. <laughs> 19. You make it over. Uh, Torvig, you are on the other side. What would you like to do? I will bonus action rage use my movement to charge and uh, yeah. Swing with a one hitting Russell and lopping off his skull. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh. Okay. 26 to hit. Hits. I'm going to try to bury this into him. Uh, for pig flopping nine. <laughs> yeah, uh, your idea of burying is sad. <laughs> no, it just meant I was two handing it. <laughs> so, uh, oh, that sucks. And uh, Octavia, you landed uh, like a sack of wet shit, but you are on the other side. What would you like to do? Am, am I like all tangled up or something? You said? Nope, you rolled a four. One, two, or three would have had you hung up like a marionette. Oh, okay. You just landed poorly. Yeah. Um, so I want we're still going after that guy? The other three are. Yeah. I wanna if you'd, like, if you'd like to loot the room, you can go ahead and do that. Loot the room? <laughs> sure. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> she murder hobos it. You find a sack of grain, sack of oats, and a small wooden box. Open the box. Open the box. Yeah, open the box. It's a mimic. No, it's not a mimic. Uh, gold and gemstones are contained within. Uh, now that three of you are engaged with me. Three? Four. Yeah, you. Two. Oh, just two? That's two. right. Yeah. Uh, odd two, even, my lord. Man. Pick number two. Uh, three. Torvig, it is your lucky day. You know what? I get two attacks, so... No, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> oh, four. I split it. Uh, so, Torvig is first. 14 plus 5, 19. That does hit. Uh, 7 plus 5, 12 on Russell. That does not hit. I'm still raging, so six. 12 plus three, 15, so seven. Uh, Russell! Oh, uh, man. All right, I'll do the only thing I can do and swing my sword. Uh, <laughs> two to hit. You suck ass, but at least you didn't hit Torvig or Clyde. Uh, Torvig, you're up. Okay, uh, going to swing. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, Clyde. Clyde. Clyde goes first. Clyde seeing all the goals and jewels. <sighs> Octavia, hand me the box and we will get out of here. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> that would be a dick move. Octavia, uh, you are a thief and I must kill you. <laughs> I approach the old man and I say, wrong. You are the sinner and you will burn in the flames of hell. And I need a dexterity saving throw. Wrong choice. 15 plus 3, 18. Passes. Yeah. Dex is not, Dex and strength are not what you want to fuck with them on. Uh, yeah, I'll fuck him with the other ways. There you go. Octavia, uh, there's a lot of gold jewels here, but it appears as though your associates behind you are still fighting this guy. Would you like to take the box in? slowly make your exit or help your friends i'm sorry help three strangers that you no longer know who they are <laughs> so can i take them i uh, like i want to take them but can i use the uh pass without trace does that make sense 
I think she can use it to get past the ballista, right? Pass without trace just gives you a plus 10 on your stealth checks. Oh, okay. Yeah, go ahead and roll stealth. Uh, 18. Add 10. She is shit in the wind, boys. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> Six. That's Russell. Five. That's Torvid. Uh, you know what? Let's use Pirate Dog Dice because I forgot to mention Pirate Dog Dice and Odd Fish Games. Torvig. Ooh, bad. Ten. Russell, 15 plus five, dirty 20. That'll, that'll kick your ass. Eight plus three is 11 damage. Russell, put this bastard out of its misery. Yeah, I hope so, because I'm hurting. Um, and that is a net 20. That's probably going to do it. Nice. All right. Damage then is double, so eight plus seven plus four, 19 damage. Uh, just barely. Uh, the man in the ram, uh, head falls to the ground, bleeding severely. Had he not cut himself earlier, he probably would have survived. Uh, your foe lies bleeding out. The ram's head crushed in the side. You all look around. Where's the druid? <laughs> yeah. uh, that'll bring us to let's kill the druid next time. Uh, hold on, hold on, wait. I need everyone to make a constitution saving <laughs> Uh, Octavia included or no? Um, <coughs> is she still in the room? Oh no, she's sh she shit gone, man. She rolled a 28. 28 to hide, not to get over a uh, oh, she was, Alyssa. She was, yeah, she was leaving, so. <laughs> well, then I won't kill them. <laughs> oh, because I rolled a four. I totally would have saved. <laughs> <laughs> That brings us to the end of issue at Skidmark. Uh, I'm going to say it was a success. You achieved your goals. And one of you is now richer by, I forget how much I put in there, 400? The chest contains 500 gold pieces and various coins, 150 gold in semi-precious stones, and odds and ends worth an additional 100 gold pieces. There you go. Nice job. Uh, nice job Oct huh? Octavia comes out uh, on top with the moolah. Russell, final thoughts. Oh, uh, man. Yeah, that was good. Uh, I feel like that the dude would have maybe not attacked me on site since all I saw was my goat head, but I appreciate the fact that he was a psycho. Did you look like his kin? I mean, he only saw my head, though I was sticking, you know, three feet above the door frame. <laughs> that, that is true. Uh, Octavia, money bags, what'd you think? Um, there are a lot of goat heads. Yeah. <laughs> How would you know your head was in the chest? <laughs> I mean, I got I, it. <clears throat> yeah, you fucked over your party. I hope you can uh, sleep. Wow. And, and, and you killed. You deserve uh, some murder hobo dice, is what you uh, deserve. That's what, yeah. Uh, you killed uh, vegetation, which is very anti druid, uh, and you screwed over your party. So you're getting yourself a whole bunch of murder hobo dice and a koozie, is what you're getting. <laughs> David, what'd you think? Uh, second time playing the barbarian yeah. <laughs> enjoyed it so and oh, yeah. and last but not least kyle i rarely play a blaster character but i must admit there's something lovely in watching your enemies burn and their embers burn baby burn <laughs> you're cold <laughs> russell how many hit points did you end up having left eight <clears throat> How oh, I could have killed him in that last blast. Octavia, <laughs> yeah. how about you? 
I, I don't know. Huh? What's your max? Thirteen. No, Four. that that can't be your max. <laughs> well, that <laughs> must have been what she was left with. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So that was close, uh, Torvig. I know I came close on you a couple times. Yeah, a couple times. I, I'm still strong. I was at twenty four. Kyle. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't have taken him out, but uh, I was at eighteen. I didn't take a hit that last fight, and I healed myself up to almost full health with one healing word. Nice. (laughs) Uh, Folks, this has been Murder Hobo Inc., uh, the one-shot edition. We got four more one-shots this month, and then uh, first month in February, we're doing campaign. We still haven't picked the cast. That will probably be at the end of this week. Uh, Are we picking the campaign setting here one of these weeks, Frank? I will be sending out an email this week to everybody who is put in to be in the campaign, except for Carol, because screw Carol, because it's all tabaxi based Good. and she hates them. We're uh, all playing tabaxi, Carol. That's right. Uh, and all three campaigns will be listed. You guys will give me first choice, second choice, third choice, uh, and then we will go from there. So uh, I have the first probably two episodes for each of the three campaigns done written public ready to publish all done uh so that's this week so this week we get up off the ground we will not be doing an online uh zero session uh or session zero rather maybe we do that i don't know but I, it's not slated for that. Uh, but uh, okay. follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our YouTube archive. If you want to shoot the shit with us, join our Discord channel. Uh, if you want to buy our crap, it's down there as well. Thank you to Pirate Dog Dice, who almost got somebody killed tonight. And, of course, Odd Fish Games. If your game stinks, get some adventure sense. And if you want to do some writing, uh, check out their Shine system as well. Folks, for all of us here at Murder Hobo Inc., Happy New Year, and we will see you on Tuesday for Between the Rolls. Let's give them the big dating game kiss and get the hell out of Dodge. Ah! Uh, <laughs> the tongue, Kyle gets. <laughs>